This is Code.org. I'm currently working on the accelerated intro to CS course, and I'm on the lesson The Farmer. Can you help me remove all four piles of dirt? Hint, use a re repeat block if you can. I bet we can. So we have one block already used when run, and they don't want us to use more than five. So one out of five is used. Let's see what we got. And obviously, yeah, that's not going to do anything yet. So it looks like we're standing on dirt already. So let's go ahead and how can we get rid of it? We can do a remove and then move forward. Let's see what this does. Oh, run. Okay, and we got that and we move forward. Then what will we do? And I'm just going to put blocks for now so I can kind of think through this. It helps me if I'm going to use a repeat to see what I need. Okay. Got it. Oh, I hit the wall. So that was too many move forwards. How about, uh, and this is what's great about code. You can be wrong a hundred times. I try to run it after each block sometimes. It helps me a lot. Okay, so now we got up there. So what would I do? And I know I'm over. I'm just testing things out. I think I would remove that. I would turn left, right? So I don't hit the wall. Uh, let's test all that. Oh, right. This is looking good. And you can watch it run. Okay. So I noticed something. First of all, I have nine blocks. Way too many. But let's look if I'm repeating anything here. Well, let me grab this. Notice that these two things here are exactly the same. Right? They're the exact same code. And if I have the exact same code, why write it so many times? Why not write it just once? and put it in a repeat, okay? I think I could even turn at the beginning, and I don't think it would make things, uh, I don't think it would break anything. Let's give it a shot though. Maybe I do need to move forward, I could be wrong. So I'm gonna get rid of all of that. I'm gonna put a repeat here. I'm just gonna start it at three, because we're just testing it. I know there's four squares. And I'm gonna start it like this. Let's see what this does. Oh, and I hit the wall. So, hmm, maybe then, what if that wouldn't work? Tricky. What if I start by moving forward, then I remove, then I turn left? And then I'll just go around twice to get it. Let's see. Because I skipped that one, but I can get it here. Ah. If I put this a four now, so I skip it at the beginning, but I can come back around and grab it. And you can watch the code run. Move forward, remove left. Zoop. Move forward, remove left. Move forward, remove left. And we got it. Awesome. That was a tricky one. Let's keep going. 